Hey guys, how are you? It's been a while since our last video. Back in August, I uh, ordered a new bike from uh, Big Mountain in Brisbane and uh, just had the phone call to say it's ready. So pretty excited. We're going to go and get, get our new bike today. And then uh, once we picked it up, we'll go and um, have a quick blast on it at a local trail somewhere. Um, but before we go um, and pick it up, I'd like to just run through the, the buying experience of buying an Obeya Rallon. Uh, it mixes uh, the best of buying online and the convenience of uh, you know, selecting what you want uh, without the hassle of a salesman or anything like that. But uh, you also get the convenience of um, supporting your local store and getting their expertise and letting them build it up for you so you know it's all perfect and ready for you to hit the, the road. Uh, so let's um, jump on the website and uh, I will show you um what i selected personally uh, what the different options are and um, run through how it works okay so if we jump on the the obeya website uh, today we're getting a, the rallon which is a 170 mil uh, travel and 160 mil travel at the back um if we click on uh, choose your rallon okay as you can see the um the rallon it comes in a few different um models Price points, depending on what suits your budget, you can go for just the frame if you want and rear shock. Um, up to the uh, M Limited. I've gone for the M10 because it fits uh, my budget a bit more. Good and poor. Okay, so first of all, this is the M10. You can choose between a matte finish or a gloss finish and you can see it changing on the screen in front of you. And then you have like 20,000 different colors to choose from, um, depending on whatever you want. I couldn't really decide, so I went with uh, an Australian theme. So I went for yellow and green. You can even uh, change your logo colors. And you can select the angle that you're looking at. Okay, so one of uh, one good thing about the Obey Rallon buying is you can select what parts you want to go on it. You can um, upgrade the brakes, the wheels, anything like that. You can see the difference that it makes to the build as well. You can have uh, a lower or a higher rise. The seat posts you can change from uh, they give you the option of the Crank Brothers High Lines or the um, Obey's own make. Uh, seat post. Now I went for the Crank Brothers purely on parts, so um, if I'm traveling uh, with my bike, if I drop in somewhere, I'm probably more likely to find emergency parts for a Crank Brothers seat post than I am a an Obeya Rallon seat post. There's nothing against the Obeya seat post, I just uh, purely went for uh, convenience when traveling on that one. Um, I'm sure they both work just as well. Uh, the fork um, you can change the saddle, you can add chain guides, the rear shock to whichever you want. It comes a choice of the, the Fox um, air shocks or the coil. I've gone for the coil, just so it's a little bit easier. Um, I, I like the way it rides with a coil and it's a bit more fit and forget where. When I have an air shock, I'm always fiddling with it, trying to make it good for every trail I go to. With the coil, I just put it on and I leave it and I'm happy with it. As standard, it will come with the Grip 1 dampener inside of the Fox 36 fork. You can upgrade that to the Grip 2. Um, I've chosen not to to keep price down, but uh, I will, in the next couple of months, put the Grip 2 in. I thought if I waited a couple of months, um, I'll definitely feel a big difference, hopefully. And then it's just a case of uh, choosing, choosing the size that you want. Uh, writing your name on the bike. Now it's yours. Select the color and hit finish. Okay, so once you've finished selecting all your paints and the parts that you want on your new bike, you uh, just have to select what store you want to pick it up from, um, and you can choose from anyone. So for me, I'm getting mine from Big Mountain in Brisbane. Uh, Adam. Runs a nice little shop down there and uh, Ben's a really good mechanic so um, pretty confident that everything will be perfect from them. Uh, they also do a lot of tra traveling and 
they do a lot of tours as well, so that they kind of understand what I'll be doing with the bike as well. So um, I hit select, and then uh, so once you've done all that, it'll give you an expected delivery date. And uh, then once you get your phone call, it'll be time to go and get your new bike. Let's go uh, down to Brisbane and pick it up. Okay, we picked up the bike from Big Mountain in Brisbane and uh, that, they took care of everything of building it up. They set it up for you. So basically all you got to do is uh, turn up, pick it up and uh, roll out of the store and into the trails. So we stopped at Tawantan on the way home. We're going to go for our first ride. The only thing left to do is uh, to put some new cleats in the North Wave shoes uh, to match the pedals. And uh, all right, let's go and have a ride. Through some more rocks. It's in a straight line, this thing really tracks well through the rocks. A little, a little bit harder to turn through these tighter corners. Really smooth through the rocks. Yo! Oh, that felt fast. That's fine. And over. Alright, set up ready for the drop. Here we go, first drop on the bay up. Woo! A little bit short. Yeah. Woo! That was easy fun. Whoa, that's good. Barely even noticed the rear end moving. Panel pop. Pretty much not existent so far. <laughs> okay, that's the first ride on the Abaya Rail I'm done. Uh, thanks to Big Mountain Cycles uh, for building it up. They've done a really good job. Uh, first impressions, it's uh, super fast in a, and, and stable in a straight line through the rocks. Um, but it, it's a bit, for me, it felt a bit sluggish on the left to right, but I'm sure that's um, more of a technique thing and me getting used to the new bike. So uh, we'll, over the next uh, couple of months, we'll make some changes to the bike and um, get it set up the way I like it. And so. If, if you're interested in some long-term reviews on a 2020 Obey Aurelon, uh, hit that subscribe button and uh, stick around and we'll, we'll have some more videos about the bike soon. See you later.